While the colonel grieved over Bingo's disappearance, I feigned concern. However, Lillian detected my insincerity. She said she could never love an insincere man, and to prove my sincerity, I had to find Bingo. Days later, I came across a flyer stating that a black poodle had been found. I went to the address provided, and there a man, Blegg, showed me the poodle. It looked identical to Bingo. I said I was its owner, left my card, and brought the dog to the Currys. The following day, the Currys came over with the poodle to express their gratitude. I took the opportunity to propose to Lillian, and she said yes. I was overjoyed, as all my problems seemed over. Suddenly, the poodle began barking at a man outside. The man said the poodle was his. To prove it, he showed me the card I'd given Blegg and commanded the dog to play dead. It happily obeyed. There was no choice but to return the poodle. Before leaving, the man mentioned his dog had dug a hole in my garden and apologized. At the insistence of the Colonel and Lillian, we went over and saw a hole exactly where I'd buried Bingo, whose body lay exposed. It looks like Bingo, Lillian cried. Finally, I confessed. As Lillian walked away, I knew I'd lost her forever. <laughs>